But then something really weird happened. I started to listen to my patients and I have a very dear patient of mine who is not a spring chicken uh, and she confided in me that her grandson brought her a doobie and if she smoked the doobie before bed, she slept better and she didn't need my Lyrica and she didn't need my Baclofen. And then a couple weeks later, another gal, again, not a spring chicken, who didn't know the first one, told me darn near the same story. And over a period of maybe a year or so, I kept hearing these older women confiding privately to their doctor that they had discovered that if they use medical cannabis, it was helping with things. And I thought that was really, really interesting. And so I went back to the literature and it still sucked. It still was not very good. But I don't think that all of these nice women who I've been taking care of for years and years were lying. I don't think they all like got in a, a, a sewing circle and said, ooh, let's all tell Boster the same thing because they didn't know each other. Um, and so I, I, I went through the coursework that you need to go through to become a medical recommender. Um, and I became a cannabis medical recommender in probably like 2019, somewhere around there. And since then, um, I have really found that cannabis can be very helpful for certain things. So let's start to talk about what it's not helpful for, all right? Cannabis does not improve your cognition. In fact, it may worsen your cognition. Now, before you throw stones, lots of other drugs can worsen cognition. Things like, uh, like gabapentin uh, and Lyrica and Baclofen. Uh, and some of the bladder medicines. I mean, so so that doesn't mean that those are all horrible. I'm just sharing that uh, cannabis is not going to help you think more clearly. I do not find cannabis to help with depression. So I've not found it to help with feeling sad and blue. And it does not help with bladder. And it does not help with balance. These are things that cannabis does not do. What it does seem to help with is insomnia. And it helps with anxiety. And it helps with pain. And it helps with spasticity. 